What's up? 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 What's up, Sunsees? What's up? This your girl, Mystic Sunflower. I'm back to give you guys a collective general energy reading. Sunsees, it doesn't matter what your sign is for this message to resonate. Just please make sure you use this discernment, take what resonate, and leave the rest behind. What's up, Sunsees? What's up? <laughs> what's up, Sunsees? Let's tap in, Sunsees. Let's see what's going on for you guys. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit. Divine, my ancestors of the highest white light, my spirit guides, my holy angels. Archangel Michael, please protect me while I channel the energy for the collective sunsets. Anything other than the highest white light, please close and shut and block that door, please and thank you. Holy Spirit, give me some messages for the collective sunsets. What are the messages? What are the most important messages that you want me to relate to the collective sunsets? Please and thank you. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Angel Michael, please put a check me and God's doors that I'm opening up. No one will be home. Thank you, Archangel okay, Michael. So, first card out is we have Mature Woman. Six on a card. Okay. So, something that could be about a choice or a decision. We have main female, mature woman and main female choice or decision. Okay. Somebody can be listening to the intuition. You could be this mature woman, very highly intuitive. We have message and wealthy man. Somebody could be wanting to message you. Mm -hmm. And we have house under the bottom. Okay, we have house, we have coffin, and pathway. You could have went through a death and rebirth. Something is changing. You could have changed. You could have went on this pathway. And now you're receiving a gift, privileged lady, high honor by your ancestors. Something, because this, this house always gives you like the four wands. Something about your stability is changing. Because you went through some type of death and rebirth. Yeah, now you're headed down this pathway. And you're receiving a gift. Okay? Something that uh, is going to put you in a privileged lady um, energy. And this is given by your ancestors. I can't make it up. High honor with great fortune. Wow. Something about your work. Something that you've been working on. Yeah, you've been, you've been taking the necessary steps. You've been doing things in the right order. Your ancestors is proud. The higher ups is proud. You went through a powerful transformation, a death and rebirth. Now your path is cleared out. You're going to be able to celebrate. Stability is looking beautiful. You're being gifted. Somebody could be being gifted with a home. The high honor to the great fortune. That's just like a ten of pentacles energy. This is ancestral. Yeah, your ancestors is blessing you with something. <clears throat> Um, I just heard somebody could be feeling like you don't deserve this. Mm -hmm. Somebody could be feeling like you don't deserve this. Mature woman and mean female. Somebody could be messaging you. Um, yeah, somebody could be, you could have made a, a, a choice. To walk away. Mm -hmm. Six and two. Number six is going to be important. This two, seven, and eight. This seven is uh, with this message. This is a chariot. Somebody is getting a message that you that you um, that something is over with that you're leaving. Yeah, the will of fortune. Something is changing in your favor. Yeah, something is over with. Somebody is getting a message. Or oh, they realizing that you're. You know, you're gone. You left. Mm-hmm. You could be this wealthy man or this person could be a wealthy man. Take it how it resonates. It's just energy. But somebody is realizing that something is over with. This person wants to reach out and message you. Somebody is fantasizing about you. This person can't stop thinking about you. This person can't stop their mind from escaping. 
Um, can't stop their mind from escaping you. This is somebody who uh, who could be pissed off that's waiting for you to uh, make the first move. Yeah, this is somebody who's very stubborn. That's why you moved on. Whoever you moved on from, somebody is is somebody want to know who's getting all your time, who you spending time with, who you who you with because it's not with them because you're moving on. And this person can't stop thinking about you. They can't um they can't allow their mind to escape you. Yeah, this is somebody who's very stubborn. This is somebody who didn't want to reach out to you. They wanted they um they wanted you to make the initiative to to reach out to them first, and you wasn't going to do that at all. Mm mm. And somebody is realizing that you're moving on. That you left. Yeah, divorce. Somebody realizing that there's an ending to a connection. To a relationship. Give me more Holy Spirit. Somebody also could have had a choice between you and um, you and someone else. Okay. What's this message, Holy Spirit? Somebody could have definitely had a choice between you and someone else. Um, someone could be definitely um, deciding to leave an energy behind and come towards you and message you. It looks like you already moved on, but let's see. Yeah, love triangle. Can't make it up. This person had a choice between you and someone else. This person was definitely seeing someone else, and you could have realized that, um, that this person was keeping secrets from you. But some of you guys, you never got the full proof. You just allowed your intuition. You got a download. Your intuition told you that this person um, was had you in some type of love triangle or dealing with someone else. Yeah, you decided to end things and go a different path, go another a different direction, and because of that, you're being rewarded by your ancestors because you're healthy because for you making healthy um, choices and decisions. And now someone is upset because. This is somebody who felt like you will always run back to them. You know, you will always try to come back and make things right. You will always try to work on things with them. You will always be the one that, you know, bend and, you know, um, bring you two back together. But somebody realizing that something has changed in you. You're not that person anymore. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They realize it now. Yeah, don't lose hope. Whoever this person is, they're um, trying not to lose hope in this connection. Yeah, they're saying they choose you. Mm hmm. This could have been someone who partied a lot. It says not the right time. Maybe it wasn't the right time between you and this person. Maybe this somebody, uh, um, you know, um, had a you know had a lot of shadow work to do. You know, this is somebody who's living out in a shadow. But you have a you have a um, with that death and rebirth and pathway, you have ascended. Yeah, you went through a transformation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And this whoever this person is, they can't accept that. Mm -mm, they don't. They don't like this change. Yeah, can't move on. I can't make it up. Give me more Holy Spirit. What's this fantasizing? Please and thank you. Somebody is having a major realization. Like, oh man, they going that death and rebirth and pathway. Somebody having a limit. Somebody like, wow, something is really over. Like you're gone. You went the whole other path. Yeah, because whoever you are, you're very mature. I'm getting like a high priestess energy. You very, um, when I say high priestess energy, um, meaning that I feel like you're very in, intuitive. You know, your intuition. You allow your intuition to guide you. Because with this message card, I feel like you got a download. Yeah, we got friend fantasizing it with friendship. Somebody could even be trying to friend zone with someone. Someone regret that. Someone regret having love, um, love, having you in a love triangle, having flings. Yeah, strategizing. This person is trying to come up with a plan and an offer that you can't confuse. What's the strategizing? Yeah, because somebody realized that you're not gonna, um, you're going. Yeah, dying in love. Somebody feels like um, whoever this person is that chooses you, they they're trying um to remain hopeful at this time because. Somebody feels like you're slipping away. Yeah, they're missing you. But a lot of you guys are focused on yourself at this time. Okay? That energy that you was putting in this person, you you pulling that, you you pulled that energy back and you're focusing on yourself. Because this person was in denial. 
This person was in denial. You. They, the head was too far in the clouds. They was partying, having love triangles, having you in flings, doing all of this. Yeah, your intuition told you, not like, no, put it into this. Yeah, they. This is somebody who's um asking for advice from their friends. This person been seeking advice from their friends. There's a lot of gossip going on about this. With this partying and gossip, there's a lot of gossip going on around this person. A lot of people could be gossiping about this person. What's this gossip? Yeah, they tell it. Wow, there's a lot of gossip that they met. Wow, the gossip is missing you and I love you. So people are talking about how how much this person is missing you and how much they love you. That's the gossip. People are saying that this person is hanging out and partying, doing things um, irresponsibly because Mystic Sunflower Collector Sunseeds left them. You know, they don't know what they do with themselves ever since they, they've been gone. Oh, wow, Sunseeds. Oh, wow. They choose you. Let's see. Let's get some more. See, a Six of Swords. Moving on. Give me more on this energy, Holy Spirit, please, and thank you for the collective Sunseeds. We have the Seven of Cups. We have the Ten of Swords. And we have the Queen of Cups. Mm. Yeah, this person is definitely in their head about you. They in, they in their head about this betrayal um, that they have caused you that allowed you that led you to, you know, go down a different path. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Queen of Cups. This person can't can't stop thinking about this. Um how much they love you. Mm-hmm. How sweet you were to them. You know? Um, they dream about you a lot. Yep. Somebody is also with the seven of cups to the ten of swords. Somebody also could be being feeling haunted or having dreams about, you know, um about this betray you. Maybe this person can't um their mind won't let them rest because what for what they did to you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. This is seven of cups energy here. Two of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, they did too much. And they could they could also feel like they they mind their thoughts is all over the place. That's why this person is trying to hang out and party and hang out with friends because they feel like if they by themselves, they constantly, constantly keep thinking about you. They constantly they head in the clouds is constantly, constantly thinking about you, what they did to you. How you was good to them, how you was how you was nurturing, how you was caring, how you was loving, how you was affectionate, how you was all of those things to them. Their mind is all over the place. Yeah, somebody can't, it's like, it, 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 um, they can't stop thinking about you. Can't stop thinking about what they did. What's this, um, what's this, um, two of pentacles in reverse? Yeah, this person's having a lack of balance right now. Something could have happened two, um, two weeks ago. I heard two years ago, but it says two weeks ago. Yeah, all of these flings and... And and the options is, and stuff this person had. This person bit off too much that they can chew. This person is, mm -mm. What's this um two of pentacles in reverse? I'm hearing you're gonna hear about something in the community. I just heard that. You're gonna hear about something in the community. That could be what's all this gossip about. Because the gossip was clarified with I love you and I um what is I love you and um and missing you. I just heard you're gonna hear about it in the community. Yeah. Yeah, page of pentacles. This person could be not working at this time. Okay, with the uh yeah, with the two of pentacles in reverse. And if this person is working, maybe this person could have like um bad spending habits. Yeah, they put their money in the wrong places. We have the Knight of Swords and the Six of Cups. Somebody from your past could be upset with you. They could be upset with you. Somebody could be angry at them. It's like somebody is angry or they upset because, because you're moving on. I don't know. This person, this is not your first rodeo where this person betrayed you before. You took them back. And this is an on and off situation or what. But something about this time is different. Yeah. And this person wants to reconcile and come back and... It's, it's, it's different this time. What's this Knight of Swords energy? Yeah, somebody is shocked. 
The Knight of Swords is clarified. Well, yeah, I'm telling you, somebody mad as hell. Four cups to the Ace of Pentacles. Somebody mad. They feel like they missed out on an opportunity with you. Yeah. Because something about you is exclusive, I'm hearing. Unlimited. So something about your blessings. Whoever you are, female or male, you are in this energy. Okay? Mm. What's the Six of Cups energy? Six of Cups energy? These could be friends. This could be romantic. Um, you know, just platonic. But these people are just feeling like they missed out on an opportunity with you. Yeah, Six of Cups is clarified with the Four of Wands. I'm telling you, something in the community. I heard earlier you're going to hear about it in the community. So people are talking about you, talking about how you know, how you're doing well for yourself, how such and such ain't been doing right since you have left, how much this person loves you, they miss you. This person loves you more than they even more than they ever even showed you. And I feel like whoever you are, this person never miss anyone as much as they miss you. And I don't feel like this is just one particular person. These are multiple people that's missing you from your past, that hurted you and did you wrong. And they're watching you be blessed. Six of Cups is clarified with the Four of Wands. These people are watching you be celebrated. They're watching you be happy. I'm hearing you guys feel like you're in a happy a happy place right now. Um, you, you feel like you're coming home. Maybe you maybe you are coming home. Maybe you go. What is you could be visiting a home place this week? Your home. But I'm I'm picking up um, internally. Somebody feels like they're coming home. Like somebody feels like they're getting back to themselves. They're getting back center. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yeah, the Will of Fortune to the Ten of Pentacles. You know why I can't make this up. Will of Fortune, Ten of Pentacles. I'm telling you, the Empress, the Empress of the Strength. They saying you out here doing it, baby. They saying you out here doing it. Wow. And they saying this person ain't been right since... Since you walked away, you could have had a major glow up when once you left this person. There is a, a um a wealthy person that's um coming in on your pathway, okay? Whatever path, yeah, six of swords. Wherever you moved on to, there's a there's a oh. Let me get this card. Six of swords to the tower. Yeah, since you moved on, it, it caused a tower. Four of pentacles. Yeah, because you holding whoever you... Yeah, you holding back from people, and it's causing a tower. People that mistreated you or hurted you feel like you're doing well. They don't even know how to come at you because they know in the past with the six of cups, they treated you poorly. So for you to be in this blessed like energy, the way how you are... And you know, Empress Strength card, the way how you persevere, it's like, how do I come at this person when I when I hurted them and I mistreated them and I treated them poorly? The will of fortune to the Ten of Pentacles. Good karma. This is good karma. It's like, how do I how do I come at this person? You know, and I, now that I want to come back around and, and reconcile and be in their life, when I know when I when I did have them in the past, you know, I hurt them. I played games. I betrayed them. Yeah, they never thought it would be you. Something could have happened three months ago. What's the tower? The tower? The tower is the king of cups. Yeah, whoever this person is, they hurt. Mm-hmm. This is somebody he was in a relationship with. Justice. It's fear. It's fear. Yeah, proceed with caution. They should they should have received with caution the way how they treated you. And they realized that. And people, I'm telling you, people are talking about it. Seven of Swords, something could happen two years ago. Yeah. Since you left. Since you left. Mm-mm. It's being talked about. It's being talked about. And these people who was lying and who was stealing from you. And they and they and you know, you maybe you could have had looted before in the past okay and they was taking that and now that spirit has blessed you up the way how spirit has blessed you up it's like you got more now and it's like dang dang yeah they probably would have loved to be around um you know now you know be around if you had this much because they were still when you had little but look how spirit that's how spirit guided you away from them because they didn't mean you well. Yeah, the chariot. The chariot to the king of pentacles. To the lovers. Mm. 
Yeah, some of you guys leaving the past behind, and you and there's a yeah the death card. I can't make it up. And there's a wealthy man, um, that's coming um coming towards you, on your pathway. Yeah. Yeah, you made a final decision about something. Mm hmm. Somebody coming in, King of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, that want to invest in you. Okay. What's this hermit? Yeah, the Temperance. I feel like that's what I said. I, I feel like um. Spirit is saying you're getting back to yourself. Like something about you is like you get um you getting centered, you're getting grounded. I feel like you had to go and hermit, okay, with the temper, you know. Um you it's like someone found a peace. They got peace, you know. This abundance, this inherence, this is like, you know, this this inheritance is having, you know, peace, um, good health. You know, um, not wanting for anything, you know, being able to do whatever you want to do, you know, um, building a beautiful life for yourself, a comfortable life, a happy life, a content life. And you got Ace of Cups. I told you there's a, <laughs> there's somebody coming towards you, a new love, somebody that's serious about you. Uh-huh. Magician, three of swords. Whoever these people was that was very manipulative, um, they're hurt, and and and, it, and it's being talked about. It's being talked about by our community. Okay, how people missing you? How people, you know, um, you know, with the I love you. How do you, how these people? Um, how much they, they talk about? How much they miss you? How much they love you? Okay. Yeah, people saying like, yeah, that person showed them nothing but love, and you know, I see why they don't want to be around. Something could happen five years ago. Something could have happened five years ago. It could have been a bunch of talk. Maybe somebody was saying something five years ago. And it's like they they what's this um uh, what's this page of wands five years ago? The ace of wands. Like wherever you maybe you was at a different place five years ago, and now where you at is like people are talking like, oh, they talking good about you. They talking good. Like maybe where wherever you at now, you wasn't in this place five years ago. What says five years ago? Um Something is good. Like, your future is bright. Also, in the next five years, something is going to be banging. But I just feel like you got a new beginning. Something is just, it's just better for you. Maybe you're, like I said, you're not in a place where you was at five years ago. It's been, it's a lot of people who didn't talk about it. Okay? Yeah, nine of pinnacles energy. Singles, independent, self-sufficient, hardworking. Whatever you was doing, you got it from the ground up. You started something. Okay, you got a promotion at your job, a hobby or something like that. That you've been doing or you've been working on, okay? Maybe it's something you've been doing on the side, but it's something that's paying off for you. What is that card? I love this for you guys. Yeah, there's a lot. Yeah, three of cups. Yeah, the nine of pentacles. You're being celebrated. Yeah, you're being celebrated. And it's a, and people are talking about it. Queen of Swords, people are talking about it. Yep. Yeah. And whatever they spitting, they spitting truth and facts about you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and secret. They talking in secret. People, yeah, I'm telling you. Ten of cups to the, the uh, page of wands. How you make how you make um very good choices and decisions. Um, yeah, you do you 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 whatever choice and decision that you made, it made you very happy, you know. You are very happy. People could see that. People could see the happiness, people could see the security, people could see the stability on you. Yeah. I'm telling you, page of cups. People want to apologize. Yeah, nine of wands. They feeling scared. They feeling you know you know kind of a little a little fairy. You know insecure because you know these are people who heard you and talked about you behind your back. Spirit said yes. They they did. They feeling insecure. They feeling scary. They they talked about you behind your back. But now look at you. Now look at you, Queen of Wands. <laughs> now look at you. Give me more Holy Spirit. Yeah, yeah, I told you. I see these people are having a major realization about you. A major. I'm going to close this out because this looks really good for you guys. You know? You allowed your intuition to guide you, you know, away from people that didn't serve your highest good. And now these people are have their head all in the clouds about you because they know they hurt you. They know they betrayed you. They know they wronged you. You know? They didn't do anything for you. But what you did for them is a whole lot. And they and, and whatever you if you didn't wherever you at now, I don't feel like you was always there. I feel like the little you had, you still was sharing, you still was giving. Whether it was your time or your energy, and they was taking that. And now it's like, wow. Look at them now. <laughs> we first got out, we have Leo. Yeah, it's like, look at them now. We have Sagittarius. Ooh. 
We have Taurus. We have Aquarius. We have Aries. We got all the fire signs. We got Virgo. We got Gemini. We got Libra. Okay. Um, and we have um, Capricorn. Happy birthday, Sagittarius. Happy birthday. This is definitely our season. <laughs> show out, show out, show out, show out. Okay. Um, and here we have Cancer under the bottom. Okay. Show out. You guys could be traveling. If so, safe travels. I know Sagittarius just love to travel. They love meeting new people. Very much people. Um, very much people, people. You know? So, happy birthday, Sagittarius. Turn up, turn up, turn up. <laughs> turn up, turn up. All right, I hope this helped you guys, guide you guys, gave you guys some clarity, sunseeds, on your situation. I love you guys so very much. Mm, and later, sunseeds.